In this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to alpha blend textures into each other, two textures into one, uh, like I also did in Call of Duty Radiant. For this tutorial, I'm going to use Call of Duty 4 Radiant. So let's get started. I haven't taught you yet how to make a patch in Call of Duty 4 Radiant. It's almost the same as in Call of Duty uh, you know, defensive radiant. I will use the same size again 384 uh, by 384. And I go to patch. You see, there is no simple terrain mesh here, this is a simple terrain patch. But if you want uh, more like curves, I will use this one simple curve patch. And the witch uh, also 7 and height 7. It fits perfectly. So now we cap it again. It's the same as in uh, United Defensive Radiant. You press S in the cap. So now you press Y. Advanced patch editing options. Everything is the same. Patch. Hello, sub selection. Uh, hello, sub selection. Uh, uh, selected patches. Uh, deselected. And height and zero dot twenty-five and I just drag it down a little bit up and down up and down up and down and maybe here up and up and down so like we got this and now we're going to cap it again press L map it will fit the one text you used in one it will cap and done and you close the advanced pet editing options now you go going to use a grass texture I'm going to use the same uh, things I'm going to do the same things as in Call of Duty United Radiant uh, grass and sand so I'm going to uh, textures usage ground somewhere around here yeah here um, I would use this one cap it but there's one thing one thing you might have noticed on the non blend textures isn't a white stroke and even on the uh, blend textures there isn't also a white stroke the blend set you can recognize blend textures by uh, underscored decal and for this texture, the cobble, you should use cobble zero one wet. That one is the blend texture. But for the rest, it's underscore decal. So now I've got non-blend texture used as my underground. So I can't fall through it if I blended it. I'm going to duplicate it. The same as in Call of Duty Night Defensive Radiant. You press spacebar and you drag it up here. Now you're going to select a night, dirt, or ground, sand texture. Um, this is a decal, this one, footprint. I will use this one. Um, CH underscore ground underscore dirt 3 underscore decal. Now what you're going to do is almost the same as in Call of Duty Defy is like is the same as in Call of Duty Night Defensive Radiant. Press Y, flatten, alpha, and drag this up to round two. Now you do the same thing. You hold Alt and move with your left mouse button slowly, so that you will get. You can also drag the outer radius a little lower like 48 so you won't get those too big too big uh, radius also here well you know we are about done And 
we see it's blended in perfectly and if it isn't bright enough I can still use another texture it's going to blend it out like this one little stones so yeah I hope uh, I've helped you to gain more mapping knowledge how to blend in a texture into another te one and check the description for a useful hint and yeah i hope i've learned you something and check out my other videos rate comment subscribe if you want so bye bye